In this lesson, I'd like to show you how to add multiple animations to one object. Let's say that I have this first object selected and I would like to have fade and for example wipe on the same object. This won't look good, but I want to have it. If I click on it, I'll just replace the original animation with wipe, but I want it to have fade in as well, for example, an exit fade. In order to do so in PowerPoint, you need to select Add Animation. This option allows you to add multiple animations to one object. So I have one animation here. I'll go Add Animation, for example, the Exit Fade Animation. And now this one object, as we can see on the timeline, and it would be good if you have the animation pane opened, so you can click here and open it. And I have two animations on the teardrop tree object. Another thing to know about is that this is not all. PowerPoint is not the perfect animation tool, but we have a few more animations than we can find here by clicking more. More entrance effects, more emphasis effects, more exit effects. Right now we have about 10 of them here, but if I select more entrance effects, I have the entire list of animations. And what is cool, if you have an object selected, you can very quickly preview all those animations. This is all I wanted to tell you about in this lesson, so you will have actually two quests here. One, you should add multiple animations to one object to see how that feels, how that looks and how to overall do it in PowerPoint. And you need to click here on this little button, more, select more entrance effects and preview all the animations you have here. I hope this will be okay for you, please do so, and then we will be able to move forward with animation and later on as we design, we will be able to make a lot of cool animations into our presentation.